Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at cattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw Little Miss Muffet. I come on the right hand side, two fingers, and put a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw a flat oval. I come on the left hand side and draw a little curve line out, in, connect. Come on the right hand side, little curve line out, in, connect. I come right down here to the bottom and I draw a straight line on the left, straight line on the right, go back to the left, connect the two with a slightly curved line. Now I'm going to come right over here on the left hand side and I'm going to draw a curved line, two, three, four, five curved lines, bring it around, up and connect. I come back to my flat oval and I'm going to draw another flat oval but little. And down at the bottom I'm going to draw one curved line, two curved lines and put a little straight curved line in the center. Come right above, I'm going to put a little straight line up, little straight line down. I come to the left and I draw one baby circle. Come to the right, draw another baby circle. Come back to the left, draw a curved line inside. Come to the right, curved line inside. Now I'm going to put one, two, three straight lines on the left. One, two, three straight lines on the right. Right where we started in the center, I'm going to draw a wavy, 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 wavy line all the way down. Connect. Jump over if you have a little bit of room. Connect. Come back to the middle, draw another wavy, wavy, wavy line out, in, connect. Right above, on the right hand side, I draw a little baby circle, then I draw straight line, curve line, straight line, connect. Draw me another straight line out, curve line, and then wherever it hits, jump over, connect. That's on the right, let's do another one on the left. Baby circle, straight line out, curve line in, connect. Straight line out, curve line in, connect. Now I come inside and I'm going to draw some little wavy lines, wavy, wavy lines on the inside. I come back over here on the left hand side. I draw a little straight line out, wavy line over, straight line up, connect. Now, since I have to color this in black because I want it to look like she's screaming, I'm going to do this section right now before I forget. So I'm coloring the inside of our little flat oval black. Okay, now I come on the left hand side and I draw a wavy, wavy, wavy line down to about there. Now, where I end, I draw a big curve line to the left, come back to the center, big curve line out to the right. Come back to the left, we're going to draw a curve line up, over, connect. Now, inside, I draw a straight line, curve line, connect, straight line, curve line, connect. Now, I'm going to draw a little curve line inside and a little curved line inside. On the left hand side I draw a straight line out, straight line out, straight line out, 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 out. So you should have one, two, three, four little baby circles at the end. Now come on the right hand side we're going to draw a curved line out, one, two, three, four, and at the end put a baby circle, one, two, three, four. Okay, 
Let's see how we're going to color her in. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is color in that spider. So I'm going to color him, his body parts, black. But I want his eyes to really pop. So those little curved lines I'm going to do red. And then I'm going to take my yellow and I'm going to do all the little baby circles for the ends of his legs. Okay? Then, while I have my yellow out, I'm going to color Miss Muffet's hair. Let's do this all yellow. Okay. And I'm going to use blue-green for her eyes. And you color this section so she looks like she's looking over at the spider. This is her tongue, so I'm going to color this section red. And I'm going, now you can do these any color you want, but I used red violet for her bows. And then I'm putting some stripes to add some color on her collar all the way down. And then I took a dark blue and I put some more stripes all the way down on her collar. Then, if you have apricot or you have pink, I'm going to do her ears, her hand, her face, and this is her neck. We're going to do this all flesh color, skin color, or if you don't have any, no color. Now, I got a green crayon just to add another pop of color, and I'm drawing straight lines in my background. All the way across, don't draw through. Little Miss Muffet, and for sure don't th draw through the spider. Okay? So there's Little Miss Muffet. Let's see what she looks like all colored in. Okay, here's Little Miss Muffet all colored in. And there's that spider who sat down beside her. Okay, bye-bye.